I got tattoos all over my body because I felt so far away from God. I was totally lost. You know, I made choices that brought me close to death. I was a tornado in people's lives, a ruined relationships. I was drinking and doing drugs every single day, and as I got deeper into my addiction, I could feel the darkness inside of me grow and the animal instincts taken over after living in the streets. And at the worst of it, I was sticking needles in my arms, and I was struggling to really stay alive. I would go into these things called trap houses, and, and the trap houses were, were exactly that. You know, you get trapped in them. The, the drug dealers would let you into the house and you would stay there all day, every day, multiple days. You know, people would die in them. Eventually, I, I, I got pushed into treatment center for the first time. And I walked in, I was angry, I had a bad attitude, and I was resisting overcoming my demons. I think it takes people most of their lives to realize that they don't want what they have anymore. What I realized is that I didn't want to live in addiction, I didn't want to be in the darkness. When I got sober, I realized that I had a second chance. I got six months sober and I went to my first yoga class. And we spent an hour and a half going through the practice. And by the time we got done, I absolutely hated it. I couldn't stand it. I couldn't touch my toes. It was like very reflective. I looked in the, into the mirror of yoga and what I saw was that is stuff that I didn't like. And I hated it. I couldn't stand it. And, and I sucked at it. And I hated being judged by others. But I judged myself so harshly. I was angry, so angry with all of the damage that I'd done. Looking back, I realized that I was in the right place, but at the time, I felt terrible. I felt like I was never coming back to yoga. I went back the following week. You know, I had the same emotional release. But for the first time in really all of my life, it was the first time that I felt value on the inside of me. I didn't feel like I was dysfunctional. I didn't feel like I was used material. I felt like I was supposed to be there. This is how I wanted to live my life. And I realized that I was supposed to be right here, right now, doing this, practicing yoga. And I could see that this is where my life was going. And this is how I wanted to spend my days. Making myself feel better, making other people feel better, and walking towards the light.